the last three years, I can proudly say um, as a SAC participant, we have more students willing to sit on the SAC, willing to open and put bring ideas to the table, willing to execute the ideas with assistance from our staff partner, community partners, our, our actual administration, and our parents, which in terms gives them, a, gives them a feeling of they belong, they mean something, and we want to see them succeed. My experience at Adair on the SAC has, it's changed over the past four years where it was initially just myself and the principal and one other individual to now we have a full engagement with the community. We say how can we make sure that we're promoting the school, that we show that the school has a lot of great things happening here. Um, and so the SAC structure really fit, it fit much better into where we were going than just home and school, which the focus was, was different. My son, he attends McClure School and since he's been in kindergarten there, we've had a SAC group there. And it's been a complete one, like 360 or 180 change. It's awesome. We have concerns as parents, and we don't just have to go to office or talk to the principal. We have an actual community group. These are parents, staff members, teacher leaders, principals, and we get together and talk about things. The wonderful thing is, literally, if you have a concern, it's addressed, and if possible, it's fixed. When I give ideas and they give me praises for it and they love it and say we're going to look into it. It makes me feel worthy. It made me feel like I'm not wasting my time, that actually someone is listening to me as a parent. And, you know, if we get a group of us together and we have this much support, I believe we can have better communication between the parents and staff. So I actually feel needed and want it. It made me feel like it's worth it. The community has grown like three, like threefold, like they're showing up. You know what I'm saying? At our meetings, and they're they're voicing their opinions, and they're writing it down, and they're coming to us, and they know they can stop me in the street, and then say, "Andy, I I have a problem. Why well, this is something I want to talk to you about?" You know. So right now, like, I am so happy with my SAC board right now for us to be one year, just one year. We started late last year, and this is just February. You know, almost February, and we're. We're doing such amazing things right now with the community. Like now the community is like actually coming together. Our principal um, interacts very well with our school advisory council and it has been a deliberate and intentional strategy, honestly, for us to have that relationship. Mm -hmm. um, because we recognize that it's not always easy to, um, as a leader of a school, to have other people giving you feedback and opinion about how your school should run. I mean, that's a, you know, dicey area, right? Uh, because we respect that the principal and the teachers, they know what they're doing. 